Hey everyone, Christine Harrington here with Eternal Life Plan. I thought I'd give you a quick update about what's happening in October and some of the information that's already out there on social media about Father Rothrock. And I was really surprised to see some people had this information, so I'm not sure how it got out, but I just want to confirm a few things, okay? First of all, Father Rothrock is and has been living on a boat since his suspension. He owns a boat and has it on uh, Lake Michigan and has been living on the boat during this whole suspension period. And uh, the other part of the news is that at this time he is not asking for any financial support uh, unless he goes public. And that decision has not taken place because it's my understanding he has a, um, a meeting with the bishop coming up over the next few weeks. Now, this isn't anything that I'm really seeing. This has already been put out there on social media, and I'm just confirming that that information is true. More information will be coming out. I'm sure my contact uh, will be talking to Father Rothrock in a couple of weeks, but he doesn't want any publicity. He doesn't want any financial support at this time. And he has not even looked at all of the articles and videos and support that he has. He's aware of it, but he decided he was going to shield himself from all of that and frankly that's probably a smart move on his part so he can stay neutral and concentrate on what's best for him so keep him in your prayers as i'm keeping him in my prayers every day now in october i have got some big announcements that's going to be coming out i was actually contacted by a reporter yesterday wanting to do an update on Father Rothrock. And we may be doing that, but we may be doing something else as well. And until that's firmed up, I don't want to tell you who it is, but I have been con contacted by a reporter yesterday. Then I've also got some other news coming out that I'm not going to say right now because I'm still in the process of firming it all up. But October is going to be a big month for Eternal Life Plan. So keep watching. And if you have any prayer requests that you would like for me to pray for you, go to my website, Eternal Life Plan, and subscribe to my newsletter. And also there's a contact form where you can also... Uh, send me a message and prayer requests. Now, I'm going to encourage you to sign up for my newsletter because I'm mailing it out once a week. And in that newsletter, you're going to find things that you won't normally find on my other social media um, platforms. I'm going to share other Catholic news with you, some updates on Father Rothrock and other priests that I'm following that I'm trying to help to support and shine light on their suspensions or silencing of their priest. If you know of any priests that are being silenced in your area, would you let me know? And I would be happy to look into that for you and also make everyone aware of all of our faithful and holy priests that are being silenced. This isn't right. This isn't right. So we got to protect our priest. Hashtag our priests matter. Make that a movement. Hashtag our priests matter. All right, I'll have more updates coming probably at the end of the week or the first of next week. Bye-bye.